Hey guys, today I have a garage sale haul to share with you guys. Um, I found something that I've been looking for for a long time that's uh, harder to find. Um, I really love Egypt and I always look for Egyptian things but I only found uh, some, some Egyptian things once and I couldn't get anything because they were expensive. But today I locked out because I found these and they were super cheap. And I found th this uh, Nefertiti I think she is. Um, like bust. I think it's bronze. I'm not sure. That's what it looks like to me. And the base looks like it's, I don't know what the base is made out of. Maybe soapstone or something. I'm not sure. And then I found King Tut over here with the same base on there. So I was really shocked that I found these today and that they, that they were really cheap. So like I said, I'm sh I think these are bronze. Bronze. They're super heavy and they're really detailed too. So that was the score of the year and then I found this cute little uh, cat figurine she's wearing this pearl this pink like pearl necklace and then she has like a gold uh, heart pendant around it and then she has like a flower between her feet over there and a flower on the bottom on this side and then she has like uh, gold eyes and gold ears and a mouth and then the back is just plain. She was super dirty, so I just got done washing her with dishwashing liquid. And she's all shiny now. Because I love cats and I collect anything with cats, especially cat figurines. So they all go, go good in my collection. And then I found this cute little uh, Valentine's Day figurine. This was only 10 cents. Oh, and the cat figurine was also only 10 cents as well which I've never seen knickknacks and figurines uh, 10 for t 10 for a dollar. They were 10 for a dollar so they come down to 10 cents each. These weren't 10 for a dollar. I don't think they were. I have to ask the person I went with. Um, I'm not sure. I think maybe these were more. I'm not sure. But these ones were 10 for a dollar so it makes them 10 cents each. And then I found this cute Valentine's Day figurine. I like Valentine's Day too. It says sweet dr sweethearts on here on the tree stump. And then that's, that's a cat. And then this is a mouse. The mouse is a cute girl and she has these overalls on with a bow in her hair. And the, the white kitty cat is a boy. And he's hiding a box, uh, he's hiding a heart behind him over here that he's gonna, he wants to give to the girl mouse. And he's wearing like red pants with a black belt. And I thought that was really cute. For 10 cents, I mean, you, you can't beat it, especially if you like things like these with cats or like Valentine's Day. And it's, a, it's pretty detailed. It's good, good quality. It's not chipped or broken or, or dirty or anything. It looks brand new. And then I like Beanie Boos, and I found this cute little Beanie Boo. I'm not sure if this came from the Walmart. Uh, I mean, from the Walmart, from McDonald's or not. It doesn't say McDonald's, but it looks like one of those little McDonald's Beanie Boos. And it says it's from 2017, and it says her, um, her name is Freckles on here from 2017. So cute. She has green eyes and green little ears. And then I found this cat water globe, and this was $5, but I talked them down to $3. And it looks like, it, like in brand new condition, like it's in brand new condition. And it has this all of these cats on the bottom. I like this picture. It's like a portrait in one of those oval pictures of a white cat and she's wearing like a pink pearl necklace. And then some more white cats on the bottom there with fa with hand fans. And I like, I like hand fans. In fact, I have a whole bunch of those hand fans from Dollar Tree. Um, I think I have at least four of them, maybe five. And another cat there and another one and it has roses and ribbons and bows everything that I like, cats, hand fans, roses, ribbons, and then inside the water globe there's just two cats, an orange tabby and a gray tabby, and the gray tabby is wearing a big pink bow around its neck, and then it has some like roses on the bottom, and then there's a fan in front of them, a hand fan, and then the orange tabby is wearing a blue bow around its neck. And then the back is super pretty. The back is my favorite. 
I mean, look at that. A hand fan with a, a rose bouquet. And then the, bu the bouquet has a pink bow on the bottom. And then it has some white flowers here as well. And a blue flower here and a blue flower there. And then on the very bottom, it has more kitties right there, another hand fan. And then um, I didn't uh, wind it up because I was in a hurry. It's a, it's a, it plays music too, and it says it plays, I will wait for you. Uh, I'm sure I'll recognize the tune, but just by the title, I don't, I don't know the song, but just by the title. But I'm sure I'll recognize it if it, if it ends up playing. There's no copyright on here. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, no copyright date, but it's from the San Francisco Music Box Company. And I used to buy stuff from there all the time in the early 90s, like from 1992 to 1993. And when I saw that it was from the San Francisco Music Box and with cats, I had to get it. Like I said, the price tag on it was $5, but I, I got it for 3 and then on the back over here, it has some roses too. So yeah, that's, I was so happy to find that because this stuff was super expensive. These snow globes or glitter globes from San Francisco Music Box back in the day. One this size, because I used to buy fantasy ones like with wizards and um, castles and stuff. And they were $40 a piece and up, $40 and up. So this probably will cost at least $40 at the San Francisco Music Box Company. But I wish it said the year on here, but there's no no year. And then I got, um, I like Siberian Huskies a lot. They're probably my favorite dog breed. Well, my favorite large dog breed, along with um, Alaskan Malamutes and Samoyas. And I found this like in mint condition. Siberian Husky, and he's really detailed. I like his eyes a lot. His eyes are, are, are really nice. They're bright blue. And then he's pretty big. He's like this size, like this. And there's nothing wrong with him. He looks brand new, like you just got him from the store. He's like pristine. And then he, he was marked... How much did I pay? Oh yeah, I paid three dollars for him right there. Three bucks. Which I think is a good deal because he's in, in like new condition. He even has his tag still on here. It says Golfa Plush. I never heard of this company. Right there. G-O-F-F-A. Golfa Plush. And I couldn't find the copyright date on here. So yeah guys, I just thought I'd share with you this uh, this garage sale haul that I got today. So thanks for watching guys. Bye.